Hey guys, so today I wanted to make a video to show you how to root your phone very easily. No computer needed. All you need is Wi-Fi connection or data, but uh, Wi-Fi is of course faster. But um, this is very simple, very easy, anybody can do this. Now I have the Samsung Galaxy Note 3 that I'm going to be doing here for this demonstration. But this should work for any Android device as far as I know. And this definitely works for KitKat. I can show you right here. If I go into my About device and um, you can see I have Android 4.4.2. So let's get started to show you how to do this. I'll have links in the video description where you can find these files. First of all, you're going to want to go to TowelRoot.com. Now you might have seen something about this already, but I'm trying to make this as simple as possible. So it's T-O-W-E-L-R-O-O-T.com. And when you open it up, it'll go to this page here. And if you want to donate to this guy, he's very helpful. Um, that's up to you. But basically, you just go to that thing and you click on this symbol. And it'll ask you what you want to do. Um, I just will do that to open it up. And then it says starting download. So then it has uh, this, this one here, the TR-1 APK. So you want to open that up and then it'll say that it's blocked. You have to go into settings and you have to check unknown sources here. And then you do that and then um, just let it install. And it says that you understand that you um, that Google doesn't want you to install this. They don't recommend it, but you want to go ahead and install anyway. And then you want to hit open. And then all you need to do is push this button say make it rain. So next what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to the Play Store and you're going to want to download this app called My Files. It's a free app and as you can see I have it installed. So go ahead and install that and then we'll come back to that in just a second. Um, so let's go back now. The next thing we need to do is download. This is so you can have super user access and um, so I'll include this this uh, link in my video description. It's downloadandroidrom.com. And anyways, when you do this, if you scroll down here, in order to do the download, they have this CAPTCHA here that you have to fill out. And so we're going to go ahead and do sun is shining. And we'll hit download. And it'll ask, says this type of file can harm you. The phone do you want to use it anyways so then we're going to download it and then um, as you can see it's super user 1 apk it's normally super user apk but since i already have it in there now next we want to go back to i'll just open the play store but you want to find this app that you found called my files and you want to open it because uh, your stock samsung one can't open this so or whatever phone you have so we'll go under download and then you can see I have this file here, so you want to open it. And then again, you've got to go to settings, and we've got to um, check the unknown sources. Hit OK, and then it asks you all the stuff you want to do. You want to hit install. Sometimes this is a little bit buggy. Sometimes it messes up a little bit, but it looks like it's doing OK now. And so we'll just hit open. And then we'll go ahead and um, just hit no thanks unless you want to follow him on Twitter. Anyways, so this gives you super user access. So if you go into your apps now, here's your thing. It's the same thing I just downloaded, your super SU. And then another cool app that I found, uh, it's on. It's in the Play Store. It costs $3. Um, it's called SQ Lite Editor. As you can see, here's Tower Root that we just did. And this thing is really cool because you can, see here's a super user request that you have to have. So you have to grant it. And then you can go and look all kinds of cool stuff. Um, you can, you know, you can access stuff that you can't otherwise. That's the whole beauty of rooting something. So I just wanted to show you how easy it is. It's so fast. Um, hopefully I was easy to follow. Um, good luck rooting your phone. And just remember, don't do this unless you know what it you're getting into. It can void your phone's warranty. Um, I've heard that before. Now this one supposedly will work without tripping Knox. I don't know if you know what Knox is, but it's a security thing that Samsung has. That uh, normally when you trip your or uh, root your phone, it'll trip it, and that way if Samsung ever looks at it or whatever, they'll know that it was rooted at one time. But um, I'm not worried about my phone's warranty. That's something you want to take into consideration if you want to do it. I can't make any guarantees, but um, just uh, yeah, this is the easiest way I've ever found to root something. So big uh, thanks to Tau Root and everybody out there to make this happen. Thanks for watching, guys.